passing game. The big glaring need we have now is that linebacker because we passed three times on Manti Teo, <laughs> <laughs> which everyone except us had uh, the Vikings uh, Vikings taking with uh, one of our one of our uh, top picks, and he fell to uh, to the uh, San Diego Chargers. Finally, picked him up. Traded up to get him. Great enough to get him. That's right. So you know, you may be very good with them, but uh, I just didn't think he was a fit at all for the Vikings, and was stunned. I mean, my thing with the with the mock drafts is that most of the people doing them are national reporters who don't have time to pay any attention to uh, you know individual teams and what teams really need. And they're tired by the time they get to the end of the draft. Twenty yeah, fifth right. pick. You're tired of looking guys up. Like yeah, yeah. 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 But but we had a lot of uh, most of the local reporters who should know better taking Teo, having Vikings taking Teo, and it might have a lot to do with uh, Spielman giving heavy hints that the Vikings might want Teo. I mean, maybe he's just that much of a master of a strate- draft strategist that he's blowing smoke everywhere. Uh, but I just didn't think he was ever a fit. For the, so I, I'm done with my, my mock draft rap rant. <laughs> <laughs>